New at six, many neighborhoods in Southern California are home to peacocks. And while the peacock is our network's favorite bird, they can also be a nuisance. Rancho Palos Verdes, for one, is overrun with them, so they'll begin trapping and relocating the peacocks. But not everybody's in favor of that plan. NBC 4's Angie Crouch now has the story. Waking up to a colorful peacock in your driveway can be a delight. Seeing one perched in a tree with its feathers blowing in the wind is a sight to behold. The birds are common in the Palos Verdes Peninsula and beloved by many residents. It's part of nature and let's make Palos Verdes unique. But here in the Vista Grande neighborhood, where people often feed the birds, their numbers are out of control. Citywide, the number of birds increased from 121 last year to 181 this year. The problem is when you have 13, 14 birds that are living in your backyard, they, they poop on your deck, they destroy your flower garden, they break your roof tiles, and this time of year during the breeding season, the males will uh, call most of the night and, and all day. <coughs> Mike Maxey is a wildlife expert who's been hired by the city council to set up large cages to trap and relocate peafowl. The city has been trapping the birds since 2014, but paused the program last year when the number became more manageable. But now they're breeding like crazy. In particular intersections by our home, there can be upwards of 40 peacocks at a time in the intersection with cars going by and people, it's dangerous. It does seem like that population growth is uh, significant. This week, the city council voted to allow Maxi to trap and relocate 50 peafowl from two neighborhoods, Sunnyside Ridge and Vista Grande, a controversial plan for some residents. We wanted to keep them here, so um, I'm not happy to hear hear that news. The birds won't be harmed and will be relocated to ranch farms between Bakersfield and San Diego where they can roam free. <coughs> Angie Crouch, NBC4 News.